you home. So guys, homo. welcome. Johnny, <laughs> shut up, you fat tart. I'm trying to do the intro. <laughs> okay, don't cut that part out. That part was great. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Anyways. Hey guys, welcome back to our third Homey House podcast. Um, so my name is Osama, and today we're going to be roasting people. Yeah. Sounds like a good day. So today, apparently TikTok's being shut down. So which is amazing. Dude, yeah. I am so happy about that. So why don't I don't have to view any more of Justy Vusty's like cursed videos? Yeah, hopefully doesn't Justin doesn't go into a fit of depression and start groping us again. But well, what, I mean, we already know what he did. Start a grinder account. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. We Justin has uh, <laughs> has done something which we will explain oh, yeah. later. Uh, yeah, he has a- after this. He has triggered us. Yeah. Um, so so people now who, we can. So now we gonna roast him. It's uh, after somewhere. after we talk yeah. about the TikTok stuff, yeah. Yeah, because like uh, we want to make sure his roast is done proper. So like we have all the time we need. Yeah, for but, real. but do I dare? But do I so, dare go all out again? Yeah, you can like go I all out. With, uh, I, 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 we, we, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Wait, did. Did we already mention his name? Because if we didn't mention his name, we shouldn't mention his name. We, did, we, we didn't, did, we didn't mention his last name. We just mentioned his first name. Let's okay, just well, call yeah, him Justy Westy, though. God damn it. <laughs> well, we know like three Justins, so it's fine. Um, God damn it, just say. <laughs> uh, so, get, give, so, how about, I don't know who's, who wants to go first, but just give your thoughts about about are you happy or are you sad that TikTok's shutting down? Dude, I can't tell you how happy I am that TikTok is shutting down. It's because, a genuine like, happiness. Yeah, it is a genuine yeah, we're happiness. All happy. Yeah. We're all happy. Like, no surprise. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know. I'm amazed it lasted this long, honestly. Yeah. I don't know, like, the actual reason why it's being shut down, but I guess, I mean, like, I won't have it's to look Big at... Papa Trump, like, got well, his panties in a bunch again. Well, yeah. the biggest thing though is like you know how you like you go on there and instantly all you see is a bunch of like little girls trying to be like yeah. seventeen. Mm. Like, You'd be into that, Justin, of <laughs> all things. I mean, Johnny. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, oh, dude, we're, we're, we're 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 getting our pedos mixed up. <laughs> I no no for real like you guys remember I used to, dude I hated that the fact that I yeah, used man, to see that. I mean, it's oh, gonna be really nice like having dementia when I'm ninety and not having to remember. Fucking twelve-year-old girls doing, doing the renegade and doing the woe and doing all this shit that they like. Okay, I helped interview somebody at my work, and in their talents, they listed that they that they were a good dancer because they had a TikTok page. And, and did you and, shoot and, them on the spot? That doesn't mean anything, though. Yeah, I know. Uh, it, what one th- one thing that is unfortunate about it is that a lot of um, music artists will suffer from it because that's where a lot of like uh, popular music gets spread. But I mean, they'll, they'll find another way. Dude, if, Wait, if they made they enough like... money off of this, they can promote stuff. Yeah. Uh, y'all heard <laughs> about like that thing that's, oh, sorry, Patrice. I don't want to like incite your wrath upon oh, yeah. me. Ladies first, ladies first, man. <laughs> oh, thanks, Papa. Hey, it's so 2020, you gotta be respectful for everybody. Yeah, even to Johnny, even if he does like men, but that's besides my point. Anyways, so, <laughs> oh god, I forgot what I was saying. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. No, so, I hope you do. I hope you never remember it. Man, you know what, Johnny? Anyways, I do remember it. Thank you, man. But I will like cut off your nuts, Johnny, and staple them to your front door. Okay, <laughs> okay. Anyways, now we have that out the way. I mean, As which I was set? Saying, I have like four sets. You have four sets of nuts? That's how manly I am. Man, no, that's <laughs> called the genetic deformity. Yeah, Johnny, it's called oh, well, the I only have one chromosome, so. That's true, OB1 chromosome. Anyways, so they're, I heard that they're replacing TikTok with something called Byte. Yeah, but the that's B-Y-B-E. just like an ad thing that, that some person decided to like start an app just because they knew TikTok was shooting down. I don't know oh. if it's actually going to become popular. If it does... I will. That's gonna be a um, bad idea. Yeah, I will become eternally depressed. Oh god! It's just a clone of TikTok. Oh, you know, you know, there's a beta feature for Instagram that is literally a hybrid of t- or a, a a a clone of TikTok. I don't remember what it's called, but like it literally, the theme of it is you have sound clips and you dance and you and you make lip sync videos to them. It's like Instagram's basically becoming t- gonna become TikTok. 
Please no. So basically, it reeks of homosexuality as well. Yes. <laughs> oh man. You you know what the worst part of it all is though, is that yeah, all I these people. Watch that, girls. No, is that like all these people that think they're popular and they think they're famous and all that stuff is now they either gonna like have to get real jobs and bitch and moan about having to actually be a human being, or they're gonna <laughs> be like, I'm gonna start an OnlyFans and ruin everyone's lives. And, like, oh, my God. oh God, dude. The, Could you imagine? The more- could you imagine Here's the future. Future. what's the start? Oh, sorry. All right. Here's the story. Here's the mortal of this. Moral? The mortal. Moral. Mo- yes. Moral. How dare you correct no, Patrice? He's calling out the fact that Johnny's immortal and that if he speaks one more time or breathes in his presence, mm. he will end his life. Keep going. The back. word is moral. Here's, Shut up, Johnny. Here's the lesson. There we go. That's Do it. not join TikTok. Yeah, fact. Why the heck you waste your time on and your life? And your life. Yeah. Exactly. Hey, Osama, what's up? <laughs> <laughs> My <laughs> gosh. Like, this is why America screwed. Yeah. I, <laughs> I remember. You, uh, you'll remember it musically. Oh, oh God, Lord. that! Don't mention oh, me. God. Don't mention me, Dad. I feel like Justy yeah. Westy was on there a lot too. Was he? I, I don't. Yeah, I don't remember. remember. He was, but he was in like middle school or, or high school, or like okay. beginning of high school. Don't you remember? Remember his ex girlfriend? Oh God, dude! I remember that. He had, he Yo, had a I still. I literally, I, I, I go on, t- okay, so I have TikTok downloaded on my phone, mostly for memes and for watching Justin because he has a TikTok for some fucking reason. Um, and you probably every, like it. And I, I didn't realize that I was still followed to you know who. And I went on my following page, which I almost never do because I just look up Justin's username and all Wait, I saw. Pennywise? Yes. No, no, no. Uh, uh, trig, trig stuff. And, uh. and, and every swipe, I see a TikTok from her and I, I wanted to barf. <laughs> Dude, I remember I was at Patrice's birthday party once. Yeah. And he was scrolling That's through his. One. Yeah, he was scrolling through his like phone, and he's like, "Oh, hey, look at this," and we look at it, and it was like it was like a thing of Trickster dancing, and then suddenly the camera cut, and like her face was like hella up into the camera, <laughs> and Patrice like hurls his phone across the room, and then we then we just start crying in a corner. <laughs> well, so <laughs> like, were, you, were, you, were you doing the Tibble watching. cry or just the regular cry? I oh, know I was doing the co- contemplating seppuku cry. Ah, uh, so you're normal cry. Yeah. You know, so, for a bunch of guys, we sure do cry a lot. For, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just gonna throw it out there. Johnny. Johnny, Johnny I heard, I heard you weep and beg for mercy when Patrice asserts his dominance over you. Yeah, especially that uh, encounter <clears throat> with Coach McClintock. Shut up. <clears throat> Shut up. Sure, I, I remember you that football. Alone. And he kicked you, you through the goalpost. <laughs> what was that? Is that in the Bible? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, okay, never mind. Or, so or that of... one time when you went to Africa, Johnny, and you got kicked out <laughs> because you oh, yeah, white. Yeah. When you became, we'll just call it inverted colors. How about that? <laughs> yeah, let's just call hey, it Hey, hey, yellow is the official tan of 2020. What the hell, Johnny? So all Chinese people are technically African-American now. Is that because you have a dick infection and your dick is yellow? <laughs> no. My oh, my thing to orange. You know what? I thought we weren't going to mention my penis, all right? This is... Oh, oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. I didn't think I couldn't mention something that doesn't exist. Now, uh, speaking of TikTok... Wow. <laughs> speaking of TikTok, we have a, uh, a friend. A that... friend, yeah. That despite claiming his Justy Westy. straightness, yes, Justy Westy, he owns his TikTok page. And how, we, how won't should, say, how we won't say the name of it, but we'll say that what he how, did how is that he was not very this? smart about it. You want me to explain it? Yeah. If yeah. You want. So Justy Westy has oh, a second channel that has the same name as his TikTok. So, he uses his second channel to comment on our first ever Homie House uh, podcast, and what ended up happening is that, uh, was it you, Josiah, that noticed it? Well, yeah, I noticed it, like, when he commented it, but I didn't know, I knew it was Justin, I thought it was just, like, 
I, don't, I thought he was just like trying to be funny or something. But yeah, apparently so, this yeah. cock sucking ass fucking tit plucking semen glugging pee pee chugging nut sack munching bench crushing motherfucker was just being an attention seeking whore and he decided to pretend he was a cyber bully and cyber bully himself and then claim it was not him even though his Instagram is linked in the channel's description. And by and, the way, his TikTok and his YouTube channel match up perfectly. Yeah, the username of his TikTok is the name of his YouTube channel. And he posts these, D mean, uh, these DJ remix things on his... Musical uh, things, by the way, like Wicked so and Wizard of Oz. Yeah. Like, he, like, I've seen all his videos. Yeah. Patrice, how dare you? Yeah, and, and I he, thought we all agreed to never watch those again. Yeah. If it was torture for me. Then why'd you dude, watch them? I remember listening to like the DJ rip, Dude. I could make a vinyl mixtape of that, and 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 I would have all the music I need for the rest of my life. Like that shit. How about that one girl you always do us with on Instagram about it? Yeah, dude. The, there was like a a girl you always duetted with, and it. But was that really was a girl. Creepy. Yeah, it was a chick. Oh, Without that all that crap on, she wasn't like bad looking. She just was not normal. Of course, Johnny, you TikTok woman looker. <laughs> I sorry. I'm sorry. I can't appreciate a good looking person. But you can appreciate Patrice all you want. Look, I'll be honest. The way I'm at, I, I really have no room to be picky. I'll be honest with you. There's no room in your doorway now. <laughs> well, to be honest, to be honest, we all remember the <laughs> one remember, doorway. You remember the uh, the hippo of our school? We won't say her name, but we all know which who it one. Is. The Wait, hold, hold up, I got you guys. Is he gonna put it? Because if it if it is. But no, dude, Patrice, don't send us a dick pic. Oh, there are several quote unquote hits. No, 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 no. It was, it started with a B. Oh, oh, oh I, wait, I think I know. I wait, is it the know. roast yeah. god? No, yes, it's, it's that bitch in our PE class. Remember, she was like, Oh, I remember. Oh, yeah, that. yeah, okay, yeah, I know, I know what you're talking about, dude. She disrespected my loyalty to Arnold once. Damn, and um, yeah. anyways, one day she came up to me and she was just like trying to roast me. I was like, listen here, hippopotamus, you cannot speak. You must go wake in your water. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> Justin Justin overheard that, and he thought that was the like, most hilarious thing. And then he tried to roast her, and he just got, like, demolished. So, was, like, Speak, speaking of demolished, uh, he also broke a bench, and then he got, like, ethnically cleansed by all the football coaches. But he would, yeah. he would never admit that he broke the bench. He gets hella, like, sore about it. Yeah. yeah. But if you look at our first podcast, there's a comment on it that we didn't delete because, I mean, who gets We refuse to delete it just to prove a point. Yeah. I mean, Justin might delete it because, like, he's <laughs> Justin. But um, basically, Dude, he, it said, like, uh, Justin must be a no life. Per- I don't even remember what it said. It was just basically. You want me to a- pull it up or something? Like, yeah. Yeah. It was basically just a comment roasting Justin. And uh, hold on. Let me pull it up. Uh, sorry. Let me just. It was like, he must have no life or something. It's like, yeah. really? Yeah, it just hella disrespected him. Okay. Here's the thing, right? Now, we can I mean, the clown sad part on each is... other all we want, but like when it gets serious and one of us actually gets hurt, that's when like we draw the line. Yeah. Like, we'll actually like, like Justin. To... Justin. Emotion is so confusing, like the animals from the new Lion King remake. <laughs> it's like, and, but if you no see one a the like expression you. of the lion in this remake, no happy. Yeah. No but Trees, they're lions. What do you want them to do? <laughs> you want them to sit they and roar like Alex and Lion from Madagascar? You want them to stick out their tongue and make an a Hugo face? <laughs> oh, yeah. God. But um, oh but like, anyways, every- no, like, when one of us like gets hurt or like we have to talk, we're legit there for each other. Yeah. But yeah. So Justin's emotions are so over the place. He's worse than like a forty-year-old woman who's bipolar with PMS. Like it's ridiculous. And uh, it- wait, isn't that you, Johnny? Yeah. No, that is Justin. We, but we thought like uh, the other three, like I knew, I knew the channel was a secondary channel because I had already watched some stuff on it. But um, uh, the other three, aka hentai. Yeah. The other three didn't know it was Justin's channel. They thought it was just somebody like being a dick to him. So they yeah, all yeah. hit us up in the group chat and there's like, hey, somebody, uh, we got to delete that comment because someone was like roasting Justin. Someone's being mean to Justin because apparently Justin had hit up Golsher saying he had been hurt by it and then he was like in depression or something because of the comment. And when, and then I like, guys, that is literally his channel. And uh, he, we, we, we kept trying to talk to him, but well, I, I didn't try to talk to him, but apparently Golsher and everyone else tried to hit him up. Yeah, I hit him up, and what happened is that, like, I legit, I asked him, I was straight up, yo, did you leave that question just to troll us? 
And it, man, his ass left me on red for like three hours. Yeah, he left him on red, and then like, and then like he tried calling him, and he's like, "What? What are you talking about?" And he he acted like like he didn't know what like was like he was trying on. to be the victim, even though damn well he knew he put that. Yeah. And like the, he he eventually he eventually um fessed up to it, but that was all yeah, and like after. I um so what <laughs> happened is that uh we decided we were okay so basically for this section we decided if he like fessed up we wouldn't like absolutely fumble him, but he ended up fessing up, but it was like too late and things were already in motion. It's yeah, like plus I like, I mean it, uh, I, I got know. mad at him because I told him like hey man you know what do what you want. But don't be like trying to make us feel guilty about you, even though you're putting that stuff about yourself. Well, yeah, because we were, we're not trying to look bad. Because it was our first episode, we're not trying to look bad in front of everybody. Because the first episode we posted immediately got like 60 views. And yeah, in like three days, it was amazing. Yeah, yeah, and then but it was weird because the next one we posted got still has like around 10 views. It doesn't make much sense, but um, we, well, probably because we no, we didn't really promote it. Yeah, true. Yeah, yeah. And, but we need basically, to start promoting this more. This is a light roast. The alternative is if he didn't fess up, we would have given him the full unleashed roast. Which unleashed. You don't, well, which I still kind of want to do that because I got mad at him because he made it sound like I was bullying him for making him try to fess up to it. Yeah. yeah you know so, what really pisses me off? Yeah. Though, that me and Justin, we've been on like hella good terms lately. Like I calmed down and then he calmed down and like, um and i guess we started becoming like better friends and then he goes and does that and i'm like man i should have clapped his cheeks when i saw him at work the other day yeah it's remember like, his life dude his live streams okay his live streams right it's, he live streams for like five hours and only has one viewer and most of the time it's either me or clorox just like saying naughty words in his like live comment feed yeah and i remember like i remember back like if you if you sort his channel's videos from by most viewed there's not a single live stream that is anywhere near the top they're all his videos that he actually records himself and i said justin i mean obviously you could do whatever he wants but you should record some like actual videos like you should do that more often record actual videos videos of yourself yeah what happened to the doll yeah the doll was was were we uh, we're, we're, yeah. Are we talking about his YouTube or his grinder? I'm uh, both. <laughs> both. <laughs> At this point, it's kind of just both. <laughs> but basically, with Justin, like he will, he Fair will enough. do really weird stuff to us out of no reason. Like we'll, we'll be benching, like in the gym, we'll be benching, and yeah. he'll come up to us and place. Oh, God his, bless Robert Frank, by the way. But yes, of course, and he will place his hand on my tit and Bro, like did, make did, a really weird like... Pennywise face, and then like. When we talk to him about it, or when we say, why are you doing that? He acts like we're bullying him, and then he acts depressed for the rest of the day, when he could have just not done that. And then, and then, remember, you, what, you remember Titus the Depressed? Yeah. <laughs> you know, no, you know what's worse, though, is I remember when he, when he, like, just, just got on my bad side that one day. Yeah. Oh, okay, I remember that. I'll tell the story. So what happened was that, like, um, Johnny was in a bad mood or something because like uh, no one combed his pubes from earlier that morning. <laughs> no, I'll tell the story right. Come on, like I don't want to seem like I'm a bully. Bro, remember oh. Ar- when Ari when you Ari pissed you off, Hella? Yeah, that was not a good day. Bro, I, yeah, I, I, yeah, I, yeah, sure. Thanks, Papa. Johnny might have to leave for a sec. Nah, uh, he. He muted. Yeah, okay, John, Johnny had to leave for a sec, but... Yeah, like um, his intro slaves came in again. Oh, by the way, guys, guys, uh, Johnny likes men. He really likes penis, and he really likes nuts, and he really likes man breast. Sorry, I had to get that out of the way. And if, if <laughs> he, was he, here, also, he, he also has a gay Cupid account. Don't tell anyone. Yeah, 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 yeah. You are aware I, I that I was here this whole time, right? I just put God. myself on mute. <laughs> <Damn>. <laughs> I heard every single word, you dumbasses. <laughs> but still... Still, just live, just in No, emotion. no, no, we're not, we're not bouncing. No, no, we're going to talk about this. You guys are assholes. <laughs> <laughs> well, John, just like, in, you would have seen it at some point. Yeah. Yeah, true. Anyways, so let's go back to that one day. So let me explain the story because you guys are going to mess it up. Anyways, I was just, I was in a bad mood that day. And I'm one of those people where, like, I'm usually in a pretty good mood. It takes it takes a lot to get me, like, in that funk of just, just being yeah. mean. Yeah, and then um, I was just in a bad mood, and Justin was just—he was just doing—he was just rubbing me the wrong way that day. He was just like being annoying. Yeah, he and, like, was whenever, on Johnny's willy a little bit too hard. 
And yeah. like whenever like I try to talk to him, we're like, hey, like, hey, shut up. So I was trying to talk. He'd get all defensive and be like, you're bullying me. <laughs> yeah, do and you I remember? Just, yeah, go, 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 go. I just, like, I got mad at him. And then, like, I was walking away because someone else was like, hey, come over here real quick. I did that. And then he, like, he, what did he throw at me? He, like, threw a bottle or something. It was a water bottle. And it, he happened to throw it just right to where it hit the back of my head. And you guys ever seen that, like, those creepy, like, movies with the dolls and there's, like, their head just spins around really slow? <laughs> oh, yeah. I just turned my body like that, looked directly at him because I knew it was him because he went, oh. And he just stared at me. But, oh, it wasn't me, Johnny. No. And then his bitch ass, like, tried to run, and I caught him. Oh, dude, I and actually remember Johnny, this. Okay, okay, the yeah. thing about Johnny is, for a big guy, he moves pretty fast. Yeah, Only when I need to. Yeah. Dude, Johnny appears to, like, when you look at him, he appears to be the type of guy that would, like, come ask you if he wants some meth and stab you if you say no. But he's <laughs> actually, wrong. it takes a lot to set him off. Like, I've, I've only seen him get actually angry, like, only a, a select few times. Well, yeah, that's because you got, you, someone was messing with you guys or I was just in a foul. No, remember when day. you were in the office and, like, they tried to make you put, put away your phone, but you had to call your mom because it was an emergency. And, like, <laughs> they, they, they ha- tried to take your phone, so you just left the school. Yeah. Dude. It takes a lot to set you well, off. Well, it was because, remember, because I was hella sick that day and I was trying to go home. Yeah. Home. And they're like, hey, you could be on your phone. I'm like, no, dude, I'm sick. I'm trying to, like, go home. Like, you want me to get everyone else sick? Because remember that? It was that same week I was gone for like, like almost two weeks because I had walking pneumonia. Dude, I thought yeah. you like got like kidnapped by Pablo Escobar those days. <laughs> Anyways, what were you gonna say? Me? Yeah, you were gonna say something. Man, I don't fucking remember. It was just like like only times I've ever been mad. Oh no, that was it. You just I've just I rarely see him get mad. I remember this yeah, one he's chick. Like, 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 yeah, he like shoved him off a desk or something, and it had yeah. already been a bad day for him. So I'm pretty sure he went off on her. I wasn't there, but I heard about it. Oh yeah, it was one of my because remember yeah. I when Johnny. Okay, when Johnny went to Napa, and Justin went and become gay here. Oh yeah, Even speaking though. of Justin, when I have to, yeah, I have to purse, and I have to dress up as a hick to scare <laughs> him up. Oh, dude, <laughs> I remember there was when Johnny left. Patrice would always be dressed up as a hick for a couple of days, like. I'm talking yeah. straight belt, In like plaid shirt, everything. Yeah. Well, because you gotta remember, Justin was like feared me. Yeah. Yeah. That's probably well, a mechanism I, for fending off of Justin. Well, af- after that day, I I almost beat the living crap out of him. You guys, who was it that came and got me? You're like, whoa, whoa, hold on, hold on, hold on. I, th- I think it was and... me. Yeah, like probably. like you guys had to be like over there because I almost like, I think I almost okay, grabbed him, slammed him on the ground. Thing was that. Yeah. Um, f- at first, like, I really wanted to see Justin get pummeled, but I'm like, wait a minute, the Incredible Bulk will probably, like, kill him, and I really <laughs> didn't want that. I, I was willing to just fucking just wreck him that day. Yeah, yeah I, I, I I saw that look in your eye. You were gonna, like, body slam him. Remember when we legitimately thought he was suicidal and depressed, and it turns out he was acting, quote-unquote? That was bullshit. Like, he's he, a goddamn, he's a, he's a terrible actor. Th- there's, like, there, no, no, there's... no. Okay, here's the thing about Justin. He is by no means a terrible actor. No, he's he a good actor. He's in drama class. Like, yeah, I've seen him he act. He's good fooled. at it. But he's, he, he uses acting for the wrong reasons. Like, I remember there was a two-month, a two- to three-month period where he would walk around and, and he would act depressed. Like, when I would ask him if he's all right, he'd be like, yeah. And he would never, he wouldn't talk to anybody. And he would, like, tell people how depressed he is. Like, he would tell people how, like, suicidal he is. And then three months later, it we we find we it turns out he 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 texts me that this entire time he's been acting as a character he has in his head or something like uh, I I don't remember what the name was it was like Titus Titus the depressed yeah, yeah Titus yeah. the depressed and he literally legitimately had like everybody worried that he was that he was not okay and yeah because like we joke acting. about him we joke about him hella but if like one of the homies is actually like I'm in some deep shit we would like always like stick out for him. But yeah, well, I'm gonna call real quick. Y'all continue. All right. All right. Oh, for those don't, who don't know, Josiah isn't actually on the call. He just got dragged out of his house by like Osama bin Laden. So people that don't know Josiah, is actually he actually is doing pretty good for himself. Uh, isn't Josiah like have hella views on SoundCloud and shit? Yeah, and on his grinder too. If you, yeah, if you keep in mind, one. Josiah can actually rap and all that. He actually makes good music. Just yeah, the problem yeah. is, though, is that Eric ruined it. Yeah, 
a uh, young Moto Moto. I'm gonna call hey, it young Moto Moto is far. What the hell you're talking about? Okay, okay, I have to go again. <laughs> oh, okay. My cake name. I like, I like how we came back for that just, just to say that. Yeah. No, but do young Moto Moto probably like the best gangster rapper and like known to Wait. man? Bro, shut up. You know Eddie, damn well he's a fucking Eddie, wannabe. Eddie. Man, don't and don't be jealous because you can't like roll up a burrito properly, Johnny. Bro, I'm amazing at rolling guys. burritos. You know, you've not seen how fat I am. I do that shit for a living. The Lord is trying to speak. Thank you. So, anyone want me to bring Big Buckle Benny and his encounter oh, with God. Justin? Do you remember um Glicka? Oh God! He had oh. he had this rap verse. Um, that uh so hold on i'm getting some okay so we he had this we had this song that we recorded um at the, at the beginning of 2019 now i actually Nine. think that like this is not a, a diss to him or anything like i actually think some of the music he makes lately is actually pretty good but back when he had just started he had record we had recorded this rap verse um we were we were in his house we were doing like a home recording we weren't like at a studio house. or anything yeah house quote unquote and uh and he had recorded a verse and we I didn't have time to like stay there and master it. I had to save it and then go home. And it turns out that like the song that the reverse he recorded was so offbeat that the producer had to see. I didn't produce at this time. I produce now. We had a different producer at the time, um, and he, the producer literally had to cut off the beat when he was rapping because it was so offbeat. And the lyrics were like, um, "I slam my belly on the tabletop and she sucks my dick like a lollipop or something." No, it was. I remember this. Dude. I have this memorized. It was. Suck my dick like a lollipop. I slam my tummy on the tabletop. Take my bitch to the beauty shop. Popping pills on my rooftop. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Are, are, are we yeah. really trying to like hype if, up Eric? Yeah, like, really. Yeah. Hype, if, yeah, yeah. Dude, Eric is so hyped that he rhymes yeah with yeah. Yeah, for real. Bro, he rhymes the hoe with yeah. Remember the song when he um Bro, he, he was so having like an asthma attack in between every line. Word. Remember, remember <laughs> that song like he wrote for song. um you know Mother uh, Gulshers and Jeremiah's wife, Mother Millie. Yeah. Yeah, that's yeah. that's Father Jeremiah's wife, by the way. Bro, I don't give a fuck. Yeah, you know what triggers me is like Johnny simps over this person a lot, and I remember one time <laughs> I like kicked Johnny and like it hit a nerve and he just died. It was amazing. Oh, dude, oh, it was Justin, Justin simping yeah, yeah. on her. No, it wasn't Justin. It was Jeremiah. No, Justin. Justin was simping on like Sailor or something. I mean, no, no, he was simping on Millie. Mother Millie. <gasps> dude, I remember what you're talking about. Remember in strength and conditioning. Oh yeah, he would stare at her. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. I remember that. He would be like this. <laughs> Y'all who no can't one see, can... we just saw the largest eyes on the face of the planet appear on okay. camera. Yeah. Can, can we all just agree that like women that dress like that, like we'll just hell slutty. And then get mad at when you like, oh, what the fuck? And they get mad. Oh, yeah. It's like, then don't dress like that, man. I mean, you, you can dress like. Oh, you don't want a don't dress, don't dress like that. Like you could that's dress like fearful. you want, but you dress, you know, you know, you dress that way on purpose, and you know you do it just to get attention. And then when you get the attention, you get mad at people. Yeah. Like, like, why are you looking? It's like because you're dressing the way where it kind of makes me look. I mean, Johnny, I'm not like a rapist, so I don't look at that. <laughs> yeah, for real, Johnny. But. <laughs> but I mean, I mean, everyone's different, okay, and that's okay. Everyone's oh. special in their own way, John. Because if, yeah. if Jesse Wussy's gonna hear this, and I don't really care because I moved, um, you guys I like how that's Johnny. Even if you didn't move, what everything. is he gonna do? Sit on you? Probably. <laughs> no, I'll probably guys, him. break. You guys right. want me to bring Big Buckle Benny? Yes. Okay. Yes, please. Right. Uh, if oh, you geez. guys can't hear, see right I'm now, getting up. if you guys can't tell, Patrice is unzipping. <laughs> Oh please God! Oh Dude, God! Please don't, please don't wow. turn on your yeah. screen because that's gonna scare but, me. <laughs> gonna, I'm, I'm so scared right Dude, now. If you turned on the screen, it would violate the Zoom guidelines, and he would get kicked off. Wait, do, is, that, is that actually how it works? Well, no. I mean, I mean, I, you can do that in, in like, if it's an actual class, you, you get, you, the teacher will kick you off. Oh, I didn't can, tell you guys, huh? The teacher, oh. the, t the teacher can report if the teacher records it. The teacher can report the person on Zoom, and they could get like banned from Zoom from having a Zoom. Yeah. Account. So check this out. So at my school, um, they were doing Zoom meetings, and what happened AKA was is that some kid legit like made the background of his thing porn, and he changed his name so they couldn't tell who it was, <laughs> and so they made everyone turn on their camera no matter what, uh. and like 
and you could, and if you gave out the password or anything to the other like Zoom meetings, you'd get suspended. Damn. Keep in mind, we're already at our home, so it's like, what, what is that really going to do? Yeah. <laughs> it's like God, that's dude. just that defeats the whole purpose. What the hell, dude? I just heard someone burn out outside my house. I think Paul might be nearby. Man, that happens hella near my house, man. Yeah. I saw a car flip over. I saw. I heard like gunshots and shit. It was just weird, weird around here. Plus, my, I live my right next to Jeremiah. So I live. Oh yeah. I live like five minutes from Jeremiah. That's and, Ni- and Nicholas. Oh god. Nicholas. Yeah, like the uh, the Minecraft kid. Oh, oh god. god. <laughs> oh god, him. Bro, we went, dude. Okay. Bro, why does fine. he smell like fish? I don't know, what, man. What? I don't. I don't. I don't want to answer that. <laughs> no, it's like my girlfriend that doesn't exist. Patrice, everyone is your girlfriend. Yeah, for real. He he. Okay, Even Patrice men. has had so has has had intercourse with so many women that he has had to result to men. Yeah. Because like, all the women right. on the world have already been used by him. There's so much. Wait, time. that means we are all children of Patrice. Yeah, basically. I don't yeah. know if you guys have realized though, but we went so fucking off topic. We yeah. we've only covered like two topics, so also <laughs> ne- the next yeah. one was um was um Johnny's uh, arch nemesis, so to speak. Pennywise. Okay, Pennywise. Pennywise. Quick brush. Pennywise. <laughs> you want to talk about Pennywise, Johnny? Oh God. Um, you know what? Someone else started off because I'll I'll try to like start start it off nicely. Right. Okay, so I, I, I'll, I met her I'll in, end up cussing them out for no reason. I met her in like uh or yeah I'll, I'll just say her. Junior high. Well, you will say her. We'll say her. Yeah. So uh, the uh, P- uh, Pennywise is a person we know that is basically just extremely loud and annoying. It's like and, imagine the hot Cheeto girl of your high school and self-centered and and conceited and a whole bunch of shit. A bit. Basically, uh, her ego is higher than I am right now. Like, yeah, if she I, is like, so white, that so white, <laughs> <laughs> like like milk looks tan compared to her. Yeah, one hundred percent. And 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 like, the, like the the voice though the voice. Do you see like, how distraught just I is trying to explain this. Seriously, yeah. like I've I'm at a loss for words, but like the voice. Is like, I'm a cat, guys. It's like it's like the most uh, like loud. Is the remember? reason why I hate, yeah, middle um, school a lot. Do you guys but, ever see white chicks? Yeah, yeah, I've seen that. Oh, remember all the yeah. remember all the rich white chicks that were like, oh my god, like they thought they were better. Everyone. Yeah, it's like that. That's yeah. basically yeah. it's like a rich, white. rich white girl who like is basically entitled. Except she's to everything. not rich. My favorite part is Terry Crews. You no, better not. You guys better not drop the name though, because then we'll be fucked. Yeah, we got. Yeah, we yeah, we're not. Like, we're not. We legit. We're not. We really care about this. Because if you name drop someone drunk. that's rich, you get sued for defamation of character. They're not even rich though. Yeah, for well, real. kind of. Because like, uh, I won't say what they do, because then it'll be obvious. But um, but they don't well, really okay. make that much money. Okay, off hold on. Honest. Imagine like, like, this honest. person is basically a third world country wearing a Gucci bill. <laughs> but you know, okay, so you know how like there are those people. Who just won't shut their mouths or if they have or they just say whatever on their mind they say whatever on their, on their mind like uh like if if they see somebody that's doing something that they don't like they don't just keep it to themselves they like why do they have to voice their opinion yeah they like oh, like every five seconds they have, they have to say just exactly what's on their mind so one time i came into a, a classroom in freshman year with a necklace on and i and uh the the, the necklace happened to be fake yeah because I was, I was, I, I didn't have a job. I was a freshman in high school, and I'll admit, yeah, the necklace was fake. Who cares? But I, I, wo- I walked in and I sat down, and the necklace wasn't like out. I wasn't like trying to be all flashy or anything. It was just tucked in my necklace. You and bought I, it because I, it looked cool. That it was hot fun. as hell. And I, and I Dude. grabbed my sweater because people do that when they're hot. They go like this. Uh. And then she looks at the, uh. she looks at the necklace. She's like, Josiah that necklace is so plastic and i i was not having a good day and i have no filter so i was like so are your tits and <laughs> that, that bitch is that, that, that bitch is flatter than a whiteboard <laughs> uh, and and me yeah, and grandmaster yeah, paul when we tricky. encounter any wife like your ball was running her over yeah. are we for real just going like, let that analogy flop it, like come on yeah, it was in independent living. Yeah. Which kind of sucks balls. Yeah. Three times, then Johnny dropping. 
Wow. And John, Johnny basically is like, okay, it's basically like for Johnny, at least it's, uh, it's like the definition. It's like the opposite of, of how attraction. a person should act. Like, yeah. no, no, I'm not talking like, about like uh, how, how you like, okay. Whenever we send a, we, we do this thing sometimes where we send a picture of her to the, to our group chat and Johnny <laughs> just like, just like gets all I have a stroke. I have and, a, I have yeah. a very big stroke. It's, <laughs> it's just bad. funny. It's not it funny, does. dude. It, it's a, oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> Actually, you want know no? Never mind. I won't say this because it's like it's actually no. Was it the was it in Raleigh's? No, it wasn't that. It was like, like that Photoshop thing I did. Oh yeah. No. Um. Oh. Should, oh, should I say what, what when I blew up on uh, Pennywise and Raleigh's? I mean, yeah. So what happens is that uh, Pennywise wouldn't shut the hell up, and I was like, I was, I didn't have any coffee that day. I was just like super tired, and then um, what ended up happening was is that. Pennywise just said the wrong thing that one morning and er, keep in mind every time this Pennywise opens their mouth uh I get very like just distraught like <laughs> you ever you ever look at someone so stupid you squint at them yeah it's like yeah you ever look at someone and wonder what is going on inside their head and just like the most stupidest stuff pops up yeah so that's basically it and then they were like dude Raleigh lit let uh let her get away with so much it was so annoying but if i did like one thing or or me and osama did one thing we yelled at like i literally asked him for an eraser because we had to share it during a test and i legit almost got detention (laughs) yeah it um, makes me less guilty when i like shot in her trash can (laughs) less guilty now anyways so we were there and dropped my balls actually so, anyways, Pennywise was just like talking mad crap about Raleigh to her face, and he's, like oh, going on the whiteboard. And I just said, "Hey, guess what? Why don't you just shut up?" And you're like, "Who are you talking to?" I'm like, "You." And they're like, "Why are you talking to me that way?" I'm like, "Cause you don't shut up." And they're like, "Oh my god, you don't even like you didn't even grow up here. You don't belong here." I'm like, "Dude, you're like Sesame Street, Cooking Monster, and Oscar, and Oscar the Grouch. It's one of these things that does not belong here." And like everyone just went quiet, and everyone's like, "Did he really just say that to her?" <laughs> <laughs> like I, don't, don't get me wrong i had to like change that a lot because there was a lot more cuss words in that and just i don't feel comfortable saying the that moral much. of the story is that johnny's an ass crack but like i'm just yeah, i'm just a very mean person to people i, don't I tell you did like, i tell you what happened in sixth grade camp no you did not but i would love like, to hear well, well, didn't Johnny I touch you? but like she like you the type is the type of person where like uh, adults will get very annoyed by by them because they'll just be talking all the time and being hell annoying. And I had that's like, basically all of us too. We, Except we had Walters, a trail dude, leader. Walters loved her. Yeah, oh, we had a, a trail leader in sixth grade camp that we would like go on hikes with. Because it was like separated by boys and girls. You had cabin leaders, but you also had a trail leader where like everybody would meet up and you'd like do a hike or something. Did you go to um, Walker Creek? Yeah. Oh, and, that's where I went for the fifth grade. Oh, I went in sixth grade, so it wouldn't have been the uh, same time. But nah. um, but uh, so. so she wouldn't like stop talking on the on the hike about like how much she wants a, a Mercedes and how much she, she wants a Gucci bag and like all this stuff, and um and she so, actually, like she needs to find rights for her stuff. And I I looked mm-hmm. at the tra- I was like looking at the trail leader's expressions and he kept rolling his eyes and like sighing and stuff. And when we got this this won't make sense in the context of what we're saying, but um we we went, got back to the end of the trail and she asked. Because you, you, have, you have to use a bathroom key to get into the bathrooms. And she asked for, to, for a key to get in the bathroom. And the trail leader gave her the men's room key. <laughs> and everybody was like, oh, oh, shit. Like, th- this won't make sense to listeners, but it'll make sense to us. If, like, if you know us and you know who we're talking about, it'll make perfect sense. Yeah. I think Patrice is dead, though. I, I, I yeah, I think I'd he died. Leave. Wait, Osama, didn't you have H.I. with her? I did. I no. I oh. yeah. I just I did. Yeah. All right. You remember when um they told you you had to write on the board like what you want to do and like what you think you need when you grow up. Oh yeah. No. She, that, this was put, this like, was in business. She like she put she, Lamborghini and stuff. Yeah. Like she, she, like everyone had to like do a presentation of what they of, of what their goals were in life and yeah. every every each person had like two or three things and it, you could see them on the board and hers was like this two page thing of just like materialistic things that she wants like like necklaces and 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 cars and and clothes not anything that she needs but just stuff she makes yeah. like yeah. cocaine i mean hey if you want that stuff fine but that shouldn't be all your goals in life cuz so my like, only goal in life is to pump and hump and that's it 
You've already well, achieved those two things with all. Well, no, like, like tell them what uh, Pennywise said to you. Me? Or the teacher, when the teacher asked her, like, hey, like, what, what do you mean by this? Fuck, I don't remember. Oh, she we, don't. I might we, have to we, tell him. You, no, it's, you could drop it in the chat and I'll try to tell it. No, it was, um, I remember when she's like, I feel like I deserve it. Like, she didn't feel like she earned it. Oh, yeah. The teacher was like, the because te- when she presented hers, it was different than everyone else's because those are just like things she wants. Like, think, it's like listing off the Christmas list. And she's like, not like a career or anything. Yeah, yeah, and she's like, "Are you sure you are you sure you want the, you are you sure those are your goals in life, or did you mi- like miss the concept of the assignment?" And she's like, "No, those are my goals in life, and if you don't like it, well, well, you can just mind your own damn business." And the and the and the teacher kind of was getting triggered with her. You know what like triggers me because so this one teacher was like hella nice to us. Oh yeah, yeah, she's a hella nice teacher, and she's but yeah. she, like she was just being hella annoying. <laughs> I think Patrice, she oh, has an alarm going off me. near my house. I think, I think like Patrice is like broken, broken into someone. Maybe that's why he muted and mu- went mute for a while. Maybe. Yo, most likely. But I think he was trying Sorry to say something. About that. Yeah, I was like running. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, Pennywise has no dignity. That's yeah, none, it. None whatsoever. Oh God. Okay, yeah. I remember. Um. So, like, Josiah was talking about the business teacher. The business teacher, like, absolutely roasted Pennywise. So, they were switching seats, and Josiah got Pennywise's seat. And uh, before Josiah sat down, um, the oh. teacher <laughs> came up, and, like, she sprayed it down and cleaned it. Then yeah, like, she like, wiped it down with, like, candy on. wipes and shit. <laughs> yeah. Bro, remember oh, uh, Raleigh had, uh, light, uh, like, was Lysol? I sprayed the like the hell out of my shirt because Pennywise touched me. <laughs> Dude, oh god, I remember that. And I, I also remember, I like, also burned that off. shirt. Yeah, I was gonna say you burned it, didn't you? Yeah, I did, but I had to wait for the rest of the day, so I put Lysol on it to help myself. Bro, do you remember what our next what we were what we were talking about next? Oh, the uh, oh, we gotta exp- we gotta explain the the uh, the Bible, the the other Bible. Oh, jeez. This, this is a subject for you guys. I'm just going to go mute for a second. Well, you're in it too, but... Uh, yeah, but Pastor Dave was like the biggest part of it, but otherwise I, I had nothing to do with it. All right. Well, the same... Pastor Dave. Pastor Dave. No, Pastor Dave is dead. Pastor Dave. Pastor Dave, Pastor Dave. Pastor Dave is dead. Pastor Dave. We can't Pastor chant. Dave. We can't chant Pastor because Zoom doesn't have like... It drowns out other people's voices. Yeah. Okay, so imagine the most supreme religion of all time. <laughs> basically we, we in 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 either seventh or eighth grade um we started this thing and it was like the it was like it was a joke it was like uh the new bible it was like the bible two or something um and we right. created a term for it called the sans abrish bible because sans abri in uh in i think latin is french. Homeless. no it's french or french is homeless yeah so we put sans abrish because it's like i don't know it just sounds sounded better um and it's and, and because we're homeless Yes. And, and they had this thing called SSR where you had to sit in your classroom and read and, and, and read stuff. So uh, uh, I, I was actually reading a book. And when I finished the book uh, in the middle of the school year, I had nothing else to do um, because I had been kicked out of the library that year, which we don't have to work, talk about. <laughs> <laughs> I remember uh, that. Oh, God, and, I remember um, too. And so me and Golsher had the idea to make the Sands Abrish Bible. Um, and we would, uh, I don't know what Gulsh, uh, when Golsher would, but I would go in SSR and I would just, we would occasionally write stories in it. And it would be like funny stories about like uh, people in the school. Um, and, and actually it ended up getting deleted off my iPad by the vice principal because she went through my iPad, but we made a new one when it came to, when it, high school Wait, came. Schaefer? No, uh, uh, Emanuele before Schaefer came. It was in oh, I wasn't grade. there then. No, yeah. I wasn't there. Oh yeah. You weren't there for that. No, you just, Okay. No, I Emanuele, was there with Schaefer. Emanuele was worse than Schaefer, if that there ain't, is there ain't possible. No <laughs> but There's yeah, no we, way. Dude, Johnny is afraid of Schaefer like to death. Yeah. I'm not even afraid. It just it, it grosses me out to a certain degree. I'm not going to lie. But um, we, 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 there's hella stories in it. There's hella characters. There's grief for Jesus. Gulsher. There's Gulsher's in it. Johnny's in it as Pastor Dave. There's um, Lord Zimbabwe. There's, uh, there's uh, yeah, Chester. All of Chester. Us- Chester the Almighty. Chester, yeah. Ainsley Harriet, Ronnie Coleman, Bob Ross, a whole bunch of stuff. Um, yeah, and, Arnold and, Schwarzenegger. Yeah, Ar- yeah, Arnold. 
and we had an idea that we would um read read bible stories uh in episodes i don't think we're gonna do it today because i don't have it pulled up but we yeah. we do that next um and we also have we're also what we're gonna do is we're gonna each each episode we're gonna interview interview somebody um and yeah. today we're gonna interview Golsher next episode um Johnny yes, said he wanted to, they wanted to interview me, but I don't know if that's for sure what we're going to do. I thought we're interviewing Golsha at the end of this. Yeah, yeah we, we are. are. We're interviewing oh, okay. him right now, but I, I'm just saying, like, I don't know who we're going to interview next. Uh, and, then, and then after we've interviewed all the people that are in this, we'll eventually invite a guest on and probably interview them. Like, maybe even invite Justin if he wants to, but he probably doesn't now that he's all probably heard about us. We'll probably still force fair, him we to would... do it. To be fair, we were just fine with it until like he like eggs us. Well, yeah, like I mean, he can't be mad at us for being mad at him for trying to make a guess. Like anyone would be mad if they, if someone was trying to make them look bad online when they had just started something out. Like I've tried to start podcasts before. I tried to start a podcast with Eric, and it just didn't work out. Well, I mean, yeah, dude, he, he's he's I don't really blame rapper. you for that one because it is Eric. <laughs> dude, it's young Moto Moto Johnny. How dare you? I don't, I don't have any respect for Eric, so I'm not going to be that way. Yeah, because what happened with Johnny is that, like, Eric accused Johnny of doing uh, – he accused, he accused me of do, me and Johnny of doing something. I don't know if Johnny did what, what Eric claimed he did, but I didn't do what Eric claimed I did. He claimed that, like, I had, like, uh, uh, ratted on him to a girl he liked and told her that he liked her, which I didn't do. I don't know if Johnny did, but I don't think Johnny did. Um, Johnny no, can so speak for himself here, on that. Here's what happened: is that he, we, we I had math the time with them, so him and Millie were talking, and Millie was like, "Yeah, whatever. You probably talk like mad crap about me and all that stuff." And jokingly, I was like, "No, no, he doesn't. He's actually hella cool." And then he started saying hella shit, and that's the day we went out with them. Oh, you probably, you know, you probably said you probably said Eric, Eric. You probably when she was saying that you probably talk shit. You probably said no. Eric likes you, but he but she probably took it the wrong way. She you you probably meant she he likes you just as a person as a friend, but I think she probably thought you meant more than that, which is I mean what a lot of people would think either way. I mean it's not no one's really really it's not really anyone's fault. But basically what what happened after is that Eric like for some reason decided to um to block both of us, and then we were we were trying to figure out what happened because um, we had no idea. Neither of us had any idea, and he explain tried to explain to it. To, to us and we had no idea what he was talking about and we eventually sorted it out like uh we, he eventually came to the conclusion that ne neither of us really did anything and but for some reason after that like he still hasn't uh fucked with us or anything like he still doesn't he still doesn't like to hang out with us um and like f for some reason he decided to like tell all of his friends that like i'm like a piece of shit or something and that like i'm, uh, a, yeah, I'm fake and like I, I, like all of his friends now think that i'm like just like this like fake snitch or whatever and and it, when it's com completely false and it was even after we had sorted the beef out he just decided to go and spread some false rumors and i don't know why and, but that's that's just, i guess on his part yeah and then no, i'm just more mad at him because instead of like being cool about it be like oh hey yeah whatever he decided to be a little punk about it and he kept trying to get in my face yeah like I, I if someone did that to me I, of course everyone's different but if someone did that to me of course i'd be like okay why'd you do that but i i, I if if I came to the conclusion that they didn't do it, I wouldn't ghost them for the rest of their life and tell everybody I know that they're a piece of shit. Yeah, and then he keeps giving me shit like, like he was still like he was still talking shit about me. Remember, um, yeah. um, Millie sings like, "Oh, this is why this is why Johnny always touches you." I'm like, I've never touched Millie. Johnny, you've touched me before. I I said Millie. Oh, okay. Excuse me. Shit. But Johnny has touched me before, and I didn't like it. I'm, I'm well, you shouldn't have been squatting so damn close to me. It's weird though. Matt, just because you're gay, Johnny, doesn't mean you need to infringe okay. upon. Do I really when, say the name? Uh, the, the reason why she got mad at you two is because of this girl. Yeah. Yeah, he thought he thought we we were talking to Millie about him, which we weren't. He, we, I, I, no, I don't think anybody was. Uh, maybe somebody else was, but it wasn't either of us. Yeah. Well, then he didn't like it too because I used to call him out on his bull crap all the time. And plus, if 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 he claims not to like her, which I believe. But if he doesn't I like know, her, no, dude, he deal. had a thing for her. We all know it. He did. He did. I mean, but like, if it, like he says he doesn't like her, and if he doesn't like her, then then why why would it matter? Yeah. Then like, then he was like, you just said that about it. I'm like, dude, I didn't say anything about you. What guys? The Lord Almighty Patrice is trying to speak. Yeah, for real. 
this is like Mordecai and Margaret or CJ in the next show. Yeah. Oh, God, yeah. I mean, it was I just ridiculous. Analogy. It was like, you, and Patrice would be skips. Yeah. I mean, I don't know if it, if like, I, ju- I just, I just don't get it. Like I, we didn't do anything and all of a sudden he just decided to leave and I'm because over he it. thinks he's a thug and he can get away with stuff like that. And he doesn't realize yeah. that I'd have no toler- tolerance for that. And I, I'm over it now, but like, it was just, it just sucked at the time. Cause like he was, he was actually a hella, he was actually a hella chill person to be around. Like on about we helped him and then he'd like lash out on us. I like, Yo, I, yeah. I remember we would, we would um, help him with his homework. Like at school, we would go around to all of his teach, uh, all of his classes, find out what missing assignments he had. And then we would go to his house. Which was like, help like all of them. Yeah. Like we, we, we would like actually help him with his, his assignments. And then when he, when he had like all F's and stuff, he blamed us. And he's like, you guys are the reason I have bad grades. And no, it's because he, he, like, he, he never went to school. Grades. And then when he did, he literally just didn't do anything. He just sat in class and just acted dumb. Well, you, he, 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 he was drawing most of class. I remember I had classes with him and he would draw like Dragon Ball Z and stuff. So we wrong. Some he, of those drawings were good, but yeah, like, drawings yeah, were good at the time, dude. Right. He, he is a good, he is a good, good artist. Wait, a good artist? No, an artist. Well, oh, okay. that, oh well, he is an artist, though. Oh, okay. Well, eventually we got to talk about the uh, the incident in the with with PE and everything with me and uh, and uh, uh, Jaden. Oh yeah, oh. like not now, oh. but but because yeah, that would take eventually. forever for me to explain. But but another yeah. Time. Yeah, let's yeah. do this next episode. Yeah. So by the way, we won't name drop anyone. So. Yeah, yeah. Well, besides Jaden, because I already said his name, and Johnny name dropped him a couple episodes ago. Yeah. Also, and he because also lives in Alaska. Alaska. Well, then again, I kind of lost. We all lost our respect for Jaden after. Well, I mean, he, he does live in any... Alaska, so it's not like he's gonna come over here. Yeah. And even um, if we, he does, he's got another thing coming. Yeah. We, yeah. I, we won't say what he did, only because, like, out of respect for what happened. Yeah, we're also not oh. we're also not a snitch, but. Yeah. And plus, when we went through that that thing, because we we were friends when it happened, and and like we actually he was actually a chill about it. But after we weren't friends anymore, he told people that he knew that I did it, even though we we both didn't do. It. Yeah, I'll, I'll, guess I'll explain what? It in the future. And guess what? He left the school. Yeah, he lives in Alaska now. He doesn't. He's home. Yeah, he lives in. Bro, he well, lives he like in. Left the school. Just the gulag now. Get, just to free himself from this trouble. Yeah. That's a cowardly move. Oh, for the record, Jaden still isn't free because he still serves as a slave. <laughs> but can, wait, before we like move on, move on, can we please talk about how we sold Eric? How what? Oh, oh, okay, okay. So I'll explain this one. So what happened is that Eric was really triggering me one day. So I'm like, you know what the hell with it? And I decided to put him up on eBay to like sell him. And I I wanted to sell him for like uh, 50 cents, but like the least they would like take is a dollar. So I'm like, okay. <laughs> and I and I shit you not, like within like didn't someone two order days, him? Yeah, yeah. From someone like from Afghanistan paid me the dollar, and they like bought Eric. <laughs> what did you send them? I didn't send them anything. Did you just send them an empty box? <laughs> no, like I, I I gave them a refund because it was like all a joke. Oh, oh okay. You should send them a picture of it. Bro, I should have like knocked Eric out and sent him overseas. Oh jeez. Alright. Um now comes the time where we get to interview Osama and see what yeah. kind of person he is. What kind of person? You know we're not I'm not a person, John. We get to see what kind of a suicide bomber he is. Oh. Yes, ma'am. So uh, for uh, the record, I don't know like any of these questions these guys have came up with. You know, we all text each other personally between each other. We didn't text us on that at all. Yeah, so, like, I'm kind of nervous. But like, let's see what this says. Don't worry. Only one of them mentions your wife. Okay. Well, or, your wa- or, or at least only one of them, at least. Jesus. All right, so how about first, you just go by introducing yourself and giving some information about you, like um, name, uh, sex. I mean, I don't know if it's obvious. Yes, please. Um, <laughs> God. Okay, yeah, et cetera. Sure. So, like, um, I, I'll give some basic info about myself. So, uh, my nickname is Osama bin Lifton, and I am 16 years old. I can't count past five as of yet, but I am, like, working my way up to it. <laughs> and hopefully I can achieve that soon, because that's, like, my dream. And I hope one day Patrice will relieve me or release me from 
um, slavery because I currently serve as Patrice's slave. Hmm. I mean, so does everyone. Yes. <laughs> yes. So how did you meet your quote unquote wife? One of them. One of them. Oh, well, uh, we met in meth. Oh, sorry, I said meth. I meant math class. <laughs> so should, should we change your name just so she doesn't get mad at us? No, it, you, you, can't, um, you can't see the screen, remember? No, uh, not her name. Well, like, okay, yeah, let's change her name. What's her name? What do you mean? Like, you know what her name is. You know what her name is. Mint. No, I know her name. I know what her name is, but, like, did you have a nickname or something? We got to no, Let's just call her, like, I don't know. A female, Flower. I guess. Flower, that's fine. Yeah, that's not close at all. <laughs> Uh, so, but like, but specifically, I don't just mean like, in math class. I mean like, mm. like, 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 how did you end up together and like how? how oh yeah, you want to know that story? Okay, so basically, it started off in oh Jesus, it started off in math class, and what happened essentially is that I couldn't like remember her name to save my life, <laughs> and and okay, like we won't name drop, but her name is Flower flower yeah and um i thought it was either flower or something else and i'm like hey is your name this or that and i guess it was both of them combined and i just felt like a retard sitting there for like five minutes <laughs> did you know she was in our pe period in sophomore year really yeah she just wasn't in your class she was in my class oh nice yeah so oh yeah and then johnny was talking about her <laughs> I Dude, wasn't that, talking about her. Johnny, you want to get ethnically cleansed, bud. Well, well no, I, I think, didn't say anything. Man, no, I, think I can, you were I can like, send a stealth bomber like there right now. I think you were talking about her like before Gulsher. I don't know before Gulsher knew oh, her. Wait a like, minute. Before they were together. I, 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 I haven't heard this story. Yeah, I, don't, I don't even know what he's talking about. I don't about, even remember. I, I vaguely remember somebody talking about her, uh, yeah. but, but it was before you guys were together or anything, and I don't remember oh, who okay. it was. I think it's a different tick. Yeah. I'm like, I'm Probably. getting mad shit over it, so I didn't even do. <laughs> I mean, that happens so often, though, to you. Yeah, so I how, know. How, explain the story about the, um, the other person and how you ended up together. The other person? We, we you, should you call know, him Sam. The person you basically removed from, from the picture. What? Hold on, I'm the, so confused right her now. Her ex. She was with shit. somebody else. Oh, yeah, okay, so she was with somebody else, right? God, you're special um, needs, I swear to God. To Johnny, your special needs. Thank you. You are special. Anyway, Thank you. Is that my, you're welcome, buddy. Everyone's special in their own way, except you don't have your own way because you're technically a slave still. Anyway. Just explain the story. Yeah. <laughs> Johnny. Johnny. Yes. No, actually, actually, never mind. I can't say it. <laughs> yeah, not, not on YouTube, bud. Keep, keep going. Yeah, so... Her ex, what essentially happened is like he wouldn't like talk to her like at all. And then like I would and then we started like becoming really close friends. And like when we told each other, um, this dude still didn't know. So um so I sent him a picture of Mario with his willy hanging out with the caption saying, It's a me. <laughs> and so like he eventually ended up ended up what? Like what happened to him? Uh, uh he's still alive, I think. Oh, oh I no one like talks to him. So basically, Skip got him. Basically, Gulsher's a pimp, and he just basically stole someone's girl out of out of the blue. Basically. So explain, describe the most embarrassing moment in all of your high school experience, not junior high, high school. Oh, high school. Okay. Um, I mean, I, I can answer that one. Wait, hold on. I, I don't. I don't. I think I know what it is. But like Johnny, type it in the chat. Um, just the creamery. Oh, well, okay. You know what? No, the creamery was just me being a retard, which happens yeah. more, which would, which happens more than I would like it to, but you got to explain what happened at the creamery. No, that's no. a, that's a, that, I, there was a that's, homie promise made to not yeah, explain it was that. A homie promise. God damn it. Anyways. Okay. This isn't really embarrassing, but I felt pretty embarrassed when this happened because um, I guess you probably won't see this. So Garrett was deadlifting, and oh, no. we and we. Asked, oh, I remember this. Yeah, yeah, and he and we asked him for weight, and he's like, "Yeah, sure, you could have one of the 45s," and but 
instead of taking the weight that was on the ground, I took the weight he was lifting while he was mid-set, and he, like, flopped <laughs> over. He, he took the weight off the bar, and just, <laughs> Garrett was looking at him, at him like, dude, are you serious? Like, <laughs> you didn't really just do that. Oh, God. Yo, what was funny is that, like, Araka was, like, bent over dead laughing. Uh, that's when I learned I had to teach you guys gym etiquette. Yeah. I mean, I don't, I don't have any more questions. I just wrote down two. Uh, y'all probably have other ones for him. Um, oh, oh, okay. So How do um, I feel, hear like nutsack crinkling? Anyway, it actually, you know, keep going. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, um, do you remember that time your dad drove us to the uh, to school? Yeah, I remember. Um, did your dad really have a gun with him? No. Okay. The uh-huh. law requires I answer no. <laughs> so what happened was is that I actually mentioned Eric in front of uh Golsher's dad and uh Golsher's dad hates Eric I, no, I didn't realize hate, it. it's because he doesn't hate but the thing is he like gets annoyed because like you know how like Eric like kept trying to break into our house yeah that was weird and, and your car yeah, uh, yeah. <laughs> he tried to like fit in the trunk once it was hella retarded yo he, he tried fitting in the back seat of an old lady's car an old random lady's car once yeah after school and, and then I saw like the car stink a little bit he thought it was Alex's car, but it was actually someone else's. <laughs> that was so autistic. Anyone else got anything? Imagine if Miss Smith. <laughs> Dude, Dude, be That's something Patrice wanted to talk about was um was uh, the science teacher at the junior high. No, she was English. Oh yeah. No, we no, can't. Smith do that was next. the science That's teacher the in high school. No, the okay, you know the rape shed. Oh yeah. yes that yeah. like the teacher behind that oh no he, he said he wanted to talk about that in an episode i don't know if you want to do it this one or next one uh i think we decided next one because like all right. uh, we're all three booked for this one all right yeah so anyone else got any questions go because i just wrote down two because i'm illiterate um and mental well, you wrote down questions for me he wrote them down oh thanks bud I'm gonna um crucify you. he actually anyway. wrote something so how so how is your wife and so how was you and your wife relationship it's actually okay okay believe it or not it's actually kind of adorable and i didn't think i would be like this question mark i don't know what that means but i and Trista. Basically, like, I am a lot more laid back, and I probably wouldn't dismember someone mm-hmm. as easily now. So, mm-hmm. basically, like, you had the assumption previously that it would have been with a boy. Yes. <laughs> he was prepared to sell his soul to the devil. How about, I mean, um... already owns my soul. How about, like, Is what's your... Captain gay? Sorry? Isn't easy. So... Here's my last question. It's pretty easy. Okay. Is Justin gay? Yes, without the shadow of a doubt. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, I got one more question. Yes, ma'am. Can we talk about the time Justin accidentally put his nutsack on your head when you were bench pressing? Oh, God. That was awful, dude. Okay, so what, what, what happened is that um, bench press is like the most vulnerable ex- exercise to do around Justy Wusty. For real, besides and- chest press. Yeah, no squats. yeah. Oh god, we really didn't squat that much, but yeah. <laughs> like what happened? Gay. You know, if he did, didn't have it. if he did the same chest press, I would do the same thing as. Yeah. He did. So basically, I felt okay. Here's the thing about Justy. He doesn't have a willy. He just has three nuts. It's called a tricycle. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so. Basically, I felt his tricycle on my head while I was bench pressing, and it, it hurt my feelings. I am Dude. emotionally scarred. I'm that. sorry, I'm not emotionally ready for that word. <laughs> I remember when we were at tricycle? Seth's party, and he. Oh God, I remember this. There was a he. Oh, he was no. he was oh, silent no. for most the of the party. Moment. Yeah, he, 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 was, he was sitting next to me and he was silent for most of the party because he didn't know many of the people there. Most of the people there were like around 20, 21 or something. And, uh, Basically and, and too old uh, for him. The first thing he said to me out of nowhere, like an hour after he, he arrived, he said nothing until he was there. And there was, yeah, there was a dog walking through the living room and he just says to me, it was, it was loud, like he didn't whisper it or anything. He just says, 
that dog has a fat cock. And then this guy next to me, this fat guy is like, you have anything you need to share with the class, Justin? <laughs> Just out of nowhere. <laughs> God, right, right. Um, I well, that's believe like, that wraps up all of our like questions. That's like the gay version of Jeremiah. Yeah. God. I have one question, though. What do you, what is your, like, your, um, your, uh, your, your dream career or goal after high school? Oh, okay. Um, dream career is FBI, actually, believe it or not. I want to go into the FBI. And the dope. only, yeah, the only reason I want to do that is so I can legally shoot Justin. <laughs> You can do that as a regular cop. That's true, but then I got like clowned up on like, oh, he shot this like illegal man. He shot this Black. illegal white boy. Yes. Is that uh? I think that's everything, right? Unless anyone has another qu- any more questions. No, that's all my questions. All right. Oh, go- oh, I have another question, Golsher. Yes. Ma'am. I finally get asked this after years of searching and studying in libraries. All the continents, all the countries. I've been studying. All the cotton fields. <laughs> Jesus Christ. All the Why are you gay? Fields. Oh, well, <laughs> I'm glad you asked. It's because Justin ruined him. <laughs> yeah. Well, okay, it's not by my own free will, okay? Because sometimes Justy Wusty just like... I don't think it's ever by your free will. <laughs> Has yeah. it ever been by your free will? Oh, yeah. Well, no. Remember the Justy Wusty lyrics? Oh, yeah. Dude, we need to sing the and, song. Yeah, speaking like, of the okay. lyrics, rem- just I remember Johnny theme song in Sophomore. Oh, yeah, I oh. still have that written down. I just don't I just don't remember it on the top Wait, of is it Wait, is, is it like he's got the children in the back? Is it that one? No, no, that was a different one. It was like, it was about Monster and about like... like foods and belt yeah. buckles. Yeah. Oh. We I'll added the children in the back later. I'll, I'll, I'll read that. that. I'll find that and, and, and we can... Like, Got me train, got me truck. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah wow, Patrice, really if you're right. going to do the yeehaw thing, you got to sound white. Yo, how dare you disrespect Patrice? Yeah. Oh, um, are That's we... why we need you, Johnny. Oh, we but, need um, you to sing that lyric. Yeah, we you have... should come back to Petaluma, man. Dude, I'm trying. You know how expensive it is, though? <laughs> yeah. Especially for people yeah. who don't have money. kind of sucks. No, I'm a knight. Oh, it's like died. a few thousand a month to live in a cardboard box. Yeah, pretty much. Assuming it, right? the fact that we actually have a box to live in, which we don't. Yeah. You're assuming we have money in the first place. That's true. I mean, for some reason, like, Gulshard, okay, he's never had a job before. But for some reason, whenever he opens his wallet, he has, like, around $100, $200 in there. And last time I he checked, sold his he was homeless. News. Yeah. Uh, um, the secret ingredient is crime, just so... Oh, okay. The secret ingredient. Like, because oh, wait, hold on, hold on. Because y'all legit think I'm joking when I say I mugged a homeless man on my way here. God damn. I think See, I don't, I don't put it past you to mug a homeless man. But the problem is, though, is that what would you do if the homeless man was secretly Arnold? Oh, dude, then I would just cease to exist. I would yeah, love I to see someone try to rob life Arnold. Then and there. God, dude. All he'd have to do is like. Smash his head into his pecs and he would, his skull would shatter. Yeah, for real. Oh, I didn't tell you guys this. So check this out. I looked up a picture of uh, Arnold as the California governor. Huh. Dude, he used to be like a little chubby. He wasn't always buff. What do you mean? He's been like, fit, cause, like, like since he was an adult. Well, think of this way. Because like when he was governor, he didn't always have time to go pump. Yeah, that so makes sense. He, 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 he lost. He, he gained a bunch of weight. He was still yeah, like actually, hella ripped, but he sense. wasn't like he wasn't like as he was like in the Terminator movies and all that. He Basically, like, what Johnny is trying to say is that he's jealous that Arnold has a willy and he. Didn't. Arnold, Arnold, Arnold had a little bit of a tum tum on him. Also, Shrek Five coming soon. Stop it! Oh yes, yeah, Shrek Five. <laughs> 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 Look out for it, guys! <laughs> Please don't. We got do the that. CD. We got the cover and everything. It's gonna be rated R, unless yeah. it's rated NC seventeen. Rated 17. Can we just say? Can we just put an X rating on it? Yeah, let's yeah. do that. That makes sense. So I think that wraps everything up, right? Yep. Yeah. All right. Uh, so I'm like the outro. I don't feel like it. Okay, sure. I'll say the outro. So, children, what we learned here today is that Johnny has an undying, undying passion for men, and that's pretty <laughs> much it. Also, we Did learned he... that Osama. 
his wife is has a bunch of pet names for him, and we're not allowed to disclose them out of a homie promise legally. I'm not allowed. To say. Yes, you may not <laughs> disclose them. Oh, by but the we way, can disclose guys, the first one. What the hell? Do it, man. Y'all just both went mute or something. Call she will she. Okay, so you 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 guys you guys don't know this, but. <laughs> I made I made Johnny. God, hey, no, no, you said that was because if I un, if I divulged the other one, not this one. Hold okay, on, let me just. Fine. We made a gay dating app for Johnny. I fucking hate you. I <laughs> never made a promise, Golsher. <laughs> I hate I hate <laughs> both of you. So many levels. I like never that. made a promise, Golsher did. Yeah, but that please. entitled you to the promise too, considering you helped. <laughs> no, he didn't help. I just made it by myself. Yeah, no, day. I didn't do anything. I just I hate yeah. all of you. <laughs> I leave you're turning 18, my guy. Yeah, Johnny's turning 18. It's it's actually yeah. real loud on there in a couple months. Shut up. Wait, what, what, what's the after, idea you're doing again? After he turns um, 18, what? I have to turn 18. Oh, no. Oh, jeez. Yeah. Well, what, are you talking about the video idea? What video idea? You just said something about a video. No, I said, what? what's the date of your birthday? Oh, the 17th of September. Oh, okay. Why couldn't you be born six days earlier, Johnny? So I'll mark that date on my calendar to find to so I could celebrate, and and and, and it'll. Why do you guys be, not know my birthday? We've been finally for how because you've never told us. We've yeah. I've told you every time you ask. No, remember last September time. September. Remember last time. Keep going. September seventeenth. Yeah, because yeah, remember why I used to say it, and you guys were like, September "Why?" September eleventh. Yeah, you guys always said, "Why could you be born like six days early? Why could you be six days early?" No, for real. Okay, but remember last time you were, we were trying to get information out of you, and you were like, "If you guys can guess my birthday, I'll tell." Because I knew you guys wouldn't be able to. Yeah, and you guys I don't are terrible. Like anyone's. Okay, birthday. the main reason we don't remember is because like you don't have parties or whatnot. Yeah, you've I'm never. Just, had, like, I'm not. A, I'm not big on them. Dude, I don't remember anybody's birthday. The only per, per, I don't even I I dead ass don't remember anybody's birthday in my entire. Family, friends, anything. I don't remember anyone's birthday, and that's just a fact. I know. Do you remember I remember, Gigi's? I remember Gigi's birthday, and that's it. How so about we only know than... we only know Patrice's because he has a party. That's like literally the only reason why we know. I have a party too, but like. Yeah, it's not because I don't care or anything. It's just because I have memory loss when it comes to dates. Basically, you know, what I, I happened like, is that Dias suffers are. from Vietnamese flashbacks of, of like the trenches and whatnot. Exactly. Yeah. But you still got to say the outro, by the way. Oh, yes. So, like, you want I, me to do it because I'm the only one that can actually do it properly. Man, I was doing it fine. And then, like, you started eggs. talking about how, like, you like men. That was you. You included the fact that he likes men and then he got upset. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. So, we're going to try. Man, Johnny. Okay, you know what? If we were actually. Mangina. Like... Johnny, I'm trying. <laughs> For real. Oh, by the way. You guys don't know this, but Johnny, but Johnny also has gelatin breasts. That's true. Yeah. This is this is why we can't have adult conversations because we act like <laughs> seven year olds around each other. I've <laughs> I've felt them with both hands. Oh God. That's not fair. I was doing a bench press and you surprised me. No, that's not what happened, Johnny. That's exactly what happened. No, no, no. no. Anyways, can someone else do the outro because you I will me start to, talking Johnny. about how. All right, I'll do it. I'll do it. Um, all right, so thanks for the uh, approximately zero people that are watching. Um, and I'll just see you in episode four. We'll be talking about. Uh, we'll be roasting. We'll we'll be roasting Hicks. We're either gonna in, we're gonna interview either me, Patrice, or Johnny. I don't know who. And we're, we're probably gonna, talk gonna about the shit. We're probably we're probably gonna roast Justy Westy again too. Like just yeah. fun of it. Because you're probably gonna yeah. do something in between now and then. And don't most likely. Don't forget about uh, Miss Brooks Long and the Shed. Well, thanks oh, for name dropping, yeah. but yeah, we're gonna talk about we're gonna talk about those two things. The Shed. We did we'll so up. good today, and Patrice just like name dropped. Yeah, yeah, dude. What the hell, Patrice? <laughs> Sorry. But but uh, we'll we'll come up with some more topics in between there. I don't know what they're gonna be. But anyway, also decide you name dropped Helen too, by the way. That's true. Earlier. Man, the only thing you dropped is the soap, Johnny. And uh, it's just, not fair. Terry Crews is behind me. I didn't know the time. <laughs> just just go All to right, bed yeah. knowing. That, that no matter what's going on in your life, no matter what trouble you're going through, no matter how depressed you are or what, what you're going through in life, Johnny will always like men. Thank you.